I think most people, when they read Paul, they're reading letters, and these letters sort of come out of the blue, um, and they're not addressed to our situation, and so we have some difficulty trying to get a handle on what's going on. And as a historian, I've always been fascinated by what's going on in the first century. And so th this book for me is a way of saying, actually, let's just live in Paul's world. Paul is an amazing whole character. He's not just somebody who on this day wrote this letter or on that day wrote that letter. So putting those letters into their historical biographical frame. And Paul comes up in three dimensions as a wonderful character. I mean, he, he must have been high maintenance as a friend, but he, he was also high value.